kind of too much. But I like it like that, you know? my channel so today i'm going to be doing a chill and casual get ready with me i'm just going to go spend the day with my friend so i don't want to do too much but i still want to be cute you know so let's get started i'm going to start with my hair it has been blow dried and flat ironed you wouldn't believe it by how poofy it is but my hair just don't it just don't it just don't do what it's supposed to do so it looks so cute like this like i almost want to lay like wear it down but i know as soon as i step outside it's gonna get even poofier so i think i'm gonna just do a half up half down with a little bang action i wish i could do i want to do a bun but my buns are my buns just don't have enough volume i don't have enough hair all right, I think that's what I'm gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna do a little half up, half down with the bang. A little crazy right now but i have my bang ping back and i have my edges setting so yeah let's get started on this makeup i literally look a little just i think a bit crazy um so yeah i'm gonna start with my charlotte tilbury airbrush flawless setting spray as my primer i just got a little bit of my nose and it itch all right next i'm going to do my brows so i'm going to take the nyx bear with me um brow setter and i'm going to use that to like put my brows into place and then i'm going to take the elf brow palmade and use that to do my brows this has been like my go-to duo if i'm not using the nyx micro brow pencil but this duo is so good so, let's get more of this I really should have sprayed my face after my brows because I just put on sunscreen so like it's like just a little it's a little slippery it's doable like it was workable a little slippery so moving on to eyes I'm literally for like my chill um makeup for my eyes I always like to put on a little bit of eyeshadow but like not too much um I just, I don't know. I've gotten over the just lashes look, but um, to prep my eyes, I'm gonna use the ColourPop Pretty Fresh Concealer. I don't hate this concealer, but it's just a concealer I just do not think about. I always pick it up to put on for, um, what's it called? To set my eyes, but like it's really a concealer. Like I, I'm always like, oh, I have to put this on under my eye. I just don't do nothing for me but it's not bad i don't know what it is all right um so like i said for the eyes i'm gonna keep it 
pretty light because I just like to put a little something something on my eyes. So I'm gonna take the Jackie Ina palette from Anastasia and I'm gonna take the color edges and I'm just gonna sweep that across my lid. I'm saying sweet, but I'm literally basically packing it on. And then I'm going to take a buffering blah. Wow, bluffing. I'm going to take a buffing brush and just buff the edges out a little bit. Sometimes I take a darker brown, like credit in the same palette, put that on the lid, and then buff out the edges with edges. Um that's funny. But Today's like literally a lot more chill. So I just need something on my lids. And this does the trick. Little dimension for the eye. I look shiny. Oh my God. All right, for lashes. I don't want for lashes. I feel like lashes is the hardest part because it really, you know, takes the look. For lashes, I'm gonna take these lashes. These are from AliExpress. These are from the brand Visofree. I think they have the best lashes on AliExpress and these are in the style E74. They're just dramatic enough to like make your eyes stand out. I don't know why I always do this, reach for something and keep talking, but yeah, they're dramatic enough to make your, <clears throat> Jeez Louise, make your eyes stand out, but like, also like not too, they're kind of too much. I like it like that, you know? And I'm just doing the trick where you put the lash glue on your actual lash line because it's so much quicker to put your lashes on. I just hate doing it because you'll literally be, you'll have your lashes off and your eyelashes will be, your eyelid will be getting stuck together. Like it's just impossible with the glue off after that. Yeah, this lash is a lot bigger than I thought it was. This is supposed to be casual. This lash is giving nighttime. It's giving, it's, wow. Y'all see that? That's a lash, baby. It's a big lash. This is not 20 millimeters. That is a lash. I have been bamboozled and led astray. It also needs to be moved a little bit. It's too far off my eye. All right, now that I got these big ass lashes on, <laughs> I feel like I, I've i led you guys astray. These lashes are so big. Anyway, moving on. I'm going to use the Fenty Beauty Ease Drop Skin Tint because this has been my jam ever since I bought it. I feel like I can take this off now. I use the Oh My, I, forgot, I think that's what it's called. Oh My, or Thank Goodness, something. If I can find the bottle, I will put the name on the screen because I just have like a skinny tester tube of it. But this edge control, it is so like resistant that it hurts to take your scarf off good and a bad thing but anyway this skin tint is it y'all if you haven't seen my review on it i just love it and it's all i've been reaching for since i since i since i got it like i love it Yeah, I definitely put way too much on. 
and that looks a little crazy. Ow! I forgot I'm not wearing a wig. Cause baby, when I be wearing a wig, anytime there's a hair on my face, I just pluck it out. Like, I just don't care. Oh, it's not that I put too much on, it's that I'm sitting in front of the lights and that's what's making me look a little crazy. We're good. Maybe. <laughs> I'm gonna put on a little bit of the Fenty Beauty concealer because Fenty everything. And I mean literally just a little bit. I've been really light-handed with the concealer lately. Continuing on with the Fenty face, I'm gonna use the um, Pro Filter Loose Setting Powder and a Sony Kashuk sponge to set under my eyes. And I literally just grab a little bit and set. I tap it right in. No baking. All right. Um, I kind of want to set the rest of my face with like a little bit of powder. So I'm going to grab that first shade was honey and this shade is nutmeg. So now I'm just going to set the rest of my face with a little bit of powder. So I'm just a little bit like too shiny and too dewy. I don't like the way it looks. And then I'm going to take my Anastasia um, powder bronzer in mahogany and this big Morphe brush and just bronze up the cheeks a little bit. I love using this big brush because it just makes it look so much more subtle and the whole carving out the cheeks look, I don't know, I'm just over it. But this, the way this looks, when you use this brush, the way that, that look that, wow, can I talk? The look that this gives you, I'm really obsessed with it. It kind of gives you like a, a blush combo Obsessed. I'm gonna set with I Nix Bear With Me. Take my bang down. For lips, I'm gonna do the Fenty Beauty Cream and Honey Waffles. There's a lot of Fenty products in here. Clearly I'm a Fenty girl. All right, and that is it for the face and the hair. All right, so here is the outfit. This shirt is from Mad Rag. It is just a cropped white long sleeve. It is my, one of my favorites. I'm probably gonna go back and pick them up in some other color because it's just, it's really nice quality for the price that it is and it just, goes with every damn thing. I just love it so much. Then these ripped denim shorts are from Fashion Nova. If I can still find them, cause they're kind of, I've had them for a while, they're kind of old. Um, I will definitely try and link them down below. Um, but my thighs are eating them up, okay? Um, but yeah, I really love them. They make the outfit look not as basic because of all the texture it adds. My bag is from BB. You guys have seen me carry it by the handle a lot but i added the strap today because wearing it long gives a lot more to the casual vibe and then for shoes i'm just wearing converse because i love me some converse and plus sneakers always set it off and then for jewelry i just kept it simple i'm just wearing my little leo necklace from vibe season and i'll probably put on my g necklace that i wear every day and that's it all right that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed and if you did make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you aren't already and until next time spread love be kind bye guys Ooh.